Hey there, it's Mark. I woke up this morning. Of course, you checked, uh, you know, the social sites, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and people were talking about it being Friday the 13th. And I thought, thought you know what? I can make a, how about I make a quick video about cars with the number 13 on it for Friday the 13th. And you know what? It was taking too much time. It's like, uh, it was hard for me to search for cars with the number 13 on it. This one right here, this is, this was in a, came in a five pack. But here it's included with a watch. You have the number 13 in spades. A Hot Wheels watch, as a matter of fact. Sometimes products are for kids. Sometimes they're for adults. This is, you agree this would be more of a kid's watch. It's just like my new Race Grooves TV channel. That's probably going to be more for kids. So, But I'm going to review this here on Mr. Grooves. Because I'm not going to play with it. I'm not, it doesn't make sense for RGTV. Whereas... This nice watch right here, I, I, this is where I would show it. Race screws, I'm going to use race screws for something else in the future. Not really something else. The channel has to grow up because a lot of people basically have grown up. Let's go ahead and take a look at these watches. Now look, if you're a collector, you can collect both of these, right? And it's your money, you buy what you want. You collect what you want to collect. This one right here is from the year 2000. And... I, I didn't buy this in a store. I don't remember seeing this. As a matter of fact, looking at the packages, it, it kind the package it kind of looks like uh, what's sold in Canada. To be honest with you, I think I just seen this at a collector show, and I don't know how much I paid for it. But now I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna put it on eBay. I'm gonna start it at two bucks, a dollar for the car, a dollar for the watch. If it sells, great. If not, I'm just gonna open it up and keep the car. And let's see what else. Uh, plastic tires, it's a regular issue. Now, as far as the watch, you can see that it celebrates the 35th anniversary of Hot Wheels, 1968 to 2003. That logo was also used in the Hot Wheels conventions. There's the Hot Wheels convention and then the Hot Wheels Nationals. Here you can see the cars that were sold at the Nationals, and they have that same logo. By the way, for the dinner, they had one of the coolest offerings ever, in my opinion. A two-pack. They had two little hypermites in a package. I attended that year, and I still have mine, and that's going to stay here with me. For the Los Angeles convention that year, they had cards as well. You can see the card art is the same. However, not only was there the convention, there was also a special Hall of Fame event at the Peterson Museum. I talked about those cars in a Hall of Fame Diora, and yet there's a... There's more than one Diora 2 if you want to check that out. I'll have a link at the end. As for the watch, it comes in this nice package. I, I, don't, I don't see a UPC, so I don't recall how it was sold. I know I got mine, but I was checking online, and there was also another package with the Chaparral 2G. I don't recall that one, but it seems to me it might have been available to the public, that package there. This is something that's special to me, so I'm going to keep mine. This one's going to stay here with me. This one, you'll be able to find that one on eBay, but I'm going to put it up for a seven-day auction. Like I said, I'm going to start it at $2. has the 35th anniversary. It's the same logo as this one right here. Nice, uh, nice quality. I did not take this out before filming the video. I don't know if there's going to be some type of information here. Nothing there. Nothing. This came out of the top. Nope. That was it, nothing. So, nice band. This one's, this one's for kids. It's pretty cool, it has a Hot Wheels Flame logo right there. And it looks like, I think, tire treads for the texture of the wristband. This one, nice smooth for an adult collector. Or if you acquire one, if you're younger, you know, that's up to you. This one had a limited edition of 750 pieces. And it says, uh, let's see, made in China, and looking for the name of who made it by E Watch Factory. So this one is 2003. Actually, this one was year 2000, uh, or about the year 2000, because that's that's when that car was released. So if you like this one, you know that one will be. Uh, oops, hold on. I need I need somebody. Can you help uh, prop this up right here? Here you go. Can you hold that for me? Thank you very much. Excuse me for a second.
that kind of stuff is going to be on Race Grooves TV. It's definitely going to be more for kids, but if, if you'd like to check it out, that's on Race Grooves TV. Here on Mr. Grooves, I talk about collectibles. As far as Race Grooves, the main mothership channel, that's probably going to grow up a bit. I'm probably going to be doing races, and I will be continuing the Hot Wheels case unboxing videos. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.